going to be doing an unboxing and a review on the Nexus 5. Hello guys, um, this video is supported by J G Tech and this is the Nexus 5. It is made by Google and LG. As you guys know, Google makes great devices and this is going to run you about $350 to $400 depending on if you get the 16 gigabyte or the 32 gigabyte. So what you're going to get in the package is of course the phone. I chose the black version. They have a they starters, have a starters kit. kit. The they charger. also have a white version that I like to call Star Wars because it's white and it has a black bezel but I prefer just a black one. And it has a SIM remover. Okay. So now that you know that what we get in the box, we're gonna go ahead and power the device on. So you're gonna, in total <coughs> specs, you're gonna get a 2.2. 2. 2. 2.26 gigahertz Snapdragon processor, which is one of the fastest processors that you can find in a phone and a amazing display at 1920 to 1080p which is 30 336 ppi's as you can see now it's turned on and the response time is fairly fast what? so the response time is fast it's running the new Android, stock Android, KitKat, and comes factory unlocked, which means you can use it with any carrier, including Metro PCS. <sighs> yeah, it just turned out. Yeah, it's, it's good. Actually, I'll just show you guys that it works on... Metro PCS right now, um, and right when you put in the SIM card, you got that pin. Never mind. So we can show you we got a SIM card right now inside. This is the Metro PCS SIM card. So once you insert that SIM, because it's factory unlocked, it automatically recognizes it, and you get LTE on the top. Let me just. Uh, So you go to settings. You guys are finishing it up. Oh, you gotta restart the um, restart the phone. Huh? It has a SIM card. Uh, maybe just put it in airplane mode and take it off airplane mode. I just want to show you it's going to come up as Metro. Because a lot of people think it won't work, but it does, and it even works on LTE. Let's turn off the Wi Fi. Maybe that's the reason. Okay. Oh, and the screen is really, really responsive. You see, this is pretty nice. You don't see any other phone like this. I think battery this is. Um, but how long does the battery last? It's probably battery. Nine what hours. So, when the Nexus 5 first released, their their battery life for the Nexus 5 was not good at all. But with their new update for KitKat, their battery life should last you about a mid's day of use with mild use. Some hidden features that you can find in your Nexus 5 is if you click on KitKat Sorry, I'm trying to find it, guys.
you can make it scroll. You see that? All right. The um, this is like the Metro PCS still not coming up. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do another video showing you guys just that it works on uh, Metro PCS network with the speed of the internet, working on LTE and all the other good stuff. I'm gonna probably put a link to it right here so you can click on this and go to it uh, once I upload that new video. All right. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is the Nexus 5. And uh, if you have any questions, please put it in the comments below. Thank you for watching.